people sometimes wonder, why do you still do this? Why do you still go out there? And the answer is found in this explanation. Um, I'm an entertainer by definition. I'm a performer and I'm a stand-up comedian. I, I don't run from those descriptions. They're all true. But because I'm a writer, first, that puts me in the world of art. I'm an artist. So I'm a performing artist and I'm a writer. And an entertainer, I think, is, is fairly static. An entertainer reaches a certain level and they are, that's what they do. And it doesn't change a lot. The songs may change, the, the voice may get deeper, but essentially they're in that place. But an artist is on a journey, I think. And he, he or she, they don't know where it is going. They, you don't know where this thing goes. Artists have a, have a restlessness. Artists have a vague dissatisfaction with things as they are. And the artist has to move on. That's why it's hard to put a painting aside. Because there's this idea that the painting isn't finished, really. Or the poem isn't finished. Uh, and and you, have to, you have to declare the, the, the painting done. You have to move on to the next canvas. But, and the artist is in that transit, always moving, always moving and growing. And an artist is, uh, as I say, never satisfied, but there is this curious restlessness. And Pablo Casals, the cellist mm -hmm. of great fame in the, in the 20th century, uh, was in his 90s when he was still playing cello, still practicing every day for three hours. And occasionally he would do um, a recital, special recital. And someone close to him said it to him at one point, you know, Senor Casal, you're in your, you're 90, you're 93 now. And yet you practice every day for three hours. Why do you continue to practice? And he said, well, I'm beginning to notice some improvement. And that's the thing that's in me. I notice myself getting better at this. I like the writing better, I like the execution better, and I like all of the technique that goes into fashioning these things, getting them ready, making sure they're the right way, the, 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 tech, the craft, the technical part of the art. And so the artist is at work, the, the, the craftsman is at work, and, and the, um, the, the show off gets to show off. It's like a good, see I didn't do my homework when I was a kid in school, didn't do my homework. Now I do my homework. But the show off still gets to go out and have fun. So I now have both of me, you know, I'm now perfectly kind of joined up together inside myself for what that's worth.